question to C. Now, you have two parts to this question. Part 1 and part 2. And they are interlinked. Here it says, when a number x is multiplied by 2, the result is squared to give a new number y. Express y in terms of x. Let's look at what this might be saying. You have a number x. So let's write our x here. It's multiplied by 2. So x is multiplied by 2. The result, what do you get as the result? Well, you could write 2x. The result, this, is squared. So 2x is squared. I have to put it in a bracket, squared, to give a new number y. So it is equal to y. Alright. If you multiply out the 2x squared, the 2 would be squared to get 4, and the x would be squared to give x squared is equal to y. I could rewrite it as y equals 4x squared. I think that's what they're talking about here. Then part 2, they say, determine the two values of x that satisfy the equation y equals x and the equation derived in C1. Alright, let's see. y equals x. You have an equation y equals x. And let's look back at this. This is y equals 4x squared. Now, one way you can think of it, y and y is the same thing. y is y. So, if y is x and y is also 4x squared, then it must be true that x is equal to 4x squared, right? Now, how do I simplify this? I could divide both sides by x to get rid of one of the x's. So if I have the left hand side over x, x cancel itself to give 1 equal. If I divide x, uh, if I divide the left by x, I must divide the right by x as well. I must do the same thing to both sides to maintain balance. So I divide the right side by x. x into x1, x into x square goes x. So what I have here is 4x. 1 is equal to 4x. If I divide by 4, divide by 4, 4 cancel 4. So you have x equal a quarter. Alright? x is a quarter here. Now that's one value. They say the two values. Now here. I could consider that y, y is the same thing as x and y is equal to 4x. I know that 0 times any number is 0. So you could say 0 equals 0. Alright? So, probably another value of x would be 0 because you have 0. Y is x, 0 is 0. And if you have y is 4x squared and 0 is 4 times 0 squared which is 0 all right so i'm thinking about it but even though i have these as the possible answers let's do a little investigation using a graph one way to solve a pair of simultaneous equation is using graph so if you plot both graphs in this case, the graph of y is x and the graph of y is 4x squared. Let's see, let's do a little graph and see what will happen. Alright. So, what I have here is my graph paper. 
one of the graph is y equal x y is equal to x so y equals x is one of the graph all right good and then y equals 4x squared so the other graph is y equals 4x to the power of 2 all right let's zoom in closer to the origin and see what's going on here all right so we have zero and zero the both lines cross at zero zero and they cross at about 0.25 which is a quarter and 0.25 which is a quarter so seem as if this is okay it's, this is correct x is a quarter and x is equal to zero 